how are you all welcome back to my channel i feel like i'm at a boardroom <laughs> So as you can tell I am not at home. I'm actually away in the New Forest for a nice long weekend with mum. We are having just a really chilled weekend um, going for some walks along the beach, cooking food, just really nice relaxing weekend. I'm staying in the New Forest. Um, I don't know if I just said that. I don't know if I said I was away for the weekend or if I'm in the New Forest. But anyway I am in the New Forest. We come here all the time, I say all the time, at least once a year, um, maybe even twice. So yeah, we do come down here quite a lot. But today I wanted to bring you a home bargains haul. It's been a while since I've done one and I've got two big bags. You can see the handle of one there and then I've got another bag here. I thought it was the perfect time to do one whilst I'm here so I can get it uploaded for you guys tomorrow, which when you're seeing this will hopefully be Sunday, all being well. So I hope you guys enjoy. I'm going to jump straight in. Let's get into it. Okay, so first things first, if you have seen my Primark haul that I uploaded last, I included a vase from Primark which was £10 and I really love it but when I went into Home Bargains I saw that they had the virtually the exact same for £3.99 so I was just like I may as well take the Primark one back and get one for half the price or more than half the price. So that's what I did, I'm going to get some tulips later and pop them in here, we're here for another two days so I thought I would get some flowers and pop them in there but it's really nice for three pounds I think it was 3 .99. it's such a good price oh my god I've just had a load of seagulls um yeah it's such a good price and it's virtually identical so I just wanted to be honest and say if you do like that or if you did like it from seeing it in my Primark haul you're better off going to Home Bargains because it's over half the price so that's my little bargain of the day so now I'm just gonna run through and see what we pick out Okay, so I saw a duvet in B&M, which was £40 or £38, I think. And it was basically the same as this, but it was white with a black trim. And I've got a cream bed, like a creamy beige bed, and I just didn't know if white and black would go. But then I saw this one, and it's definitely more of like a creamy, um, natural sort of tone. So I got this one in a double. It's just got the black trim. It's like that soft feel, 100% cotton double duvet let me grab the receipt so i can tell you how much it was so this one was 19.99 which is also cheaper than the bnm one and i much prefer it because it's more of a natural color my friend was also with me at the time and i said to her I was like, oh do you like it and we did like it but we felt like it was probably not the best quality whereas this one i think seems a lot nicer and they've actually got it paired with um the same color bed as mine so it was a no-brainer would it be a home bargains haul without some food obviously not these are my favorite little snack bags sweet and salty popcorn you get six in there and they were one pound 49 i may as well give you the breakdown of all the costs seeing as i've got the receipt here okay next up so mother's day is next weekend but i'm actually not here for mother's day um so i'm gonna celebrate it whilst we're here with mum um so a few of these bits are kind of mother's day related but last year home bargains did a little gift set with some little mini candles in and one of them was called rose garden anyway i know that sometimes when you buy the little candles they don't always smell and it's a bit like oh they don't actually smell that great but rose garden you could really smell it's not amazing it like made the whole room smell really nice and then i saw they had a big one so i'm actually going to give this to mum for mother's day it was 2.99 it smells so good and it is the one candle from home bargains i absolutely love um this time of year they do some nice christmasy ones but this one smells amazing so if you haven't smelt rose garden yet grab it and you'll see what i mean because it smells so nice and you can actually smell it even though the last one i tried was only like this big so i'm hoping the big one is still the same but i will let you know and then for 79p i've got my easter prep on so i got one of these for my nephew and two of these for my nieces uh, one each so i've got two nieces and a nephew um they are just little like cookie biscuits um with the icing on so i got a bunny and then two little chicks and 79p they've got so many nice easter bits in there like honestly i can't wait to be a mum hopefully one day because um <laughs> they have got so many cute little easter decoration bits and like easter egg hunts and yeah i mean i do buy little bits and bobs for my nieces and nephew but i do feel like i'm just gonna go all out when i have children so um yeah i got those for them then for 2.99 each they actually had yankee candles and i actually bought a big one of these in tk maxx you may have seen it in my december tk maxx haul but these are called raspberry sunday oh 
they smell so good so i've got another one for mum she's in the other room um and then i also got one for my friend for her birthday which is coming up just as like a little something then i also got mum some shortbread because <laughs> if you've been here a while you know that mum loves a biscuit as do i so it's kind of like a tactical buy because it means i can have some these were there we go, 99p, bargain. And the reason I got these, you'll see in a minute, because I picked up some bits from Habitat in Sainsbury's, and I'm gonna include them within this haul, because I think you've still got a week until Mother's Day, so if any of you are still looking, then you'll see what I got. I then also picked up this for one, oh sorry, for seven, 79p, oh my gosh, that's crazy. I just got a little vodka lime and soda to have this weekend. It's apparently got zero sugar, 69 calories. I do love a vodka lime and soda, so yeah, I just grabbed one of those. No idea what it's gonna taste like. It's the VK brand, which just takes me back to when I was going to like house parties when I was a teenager, but we're gonna give it a go. So before I go on to the second bag of home bargain stuff, let me show you the bits I got from Sainsbury's. Annoyingly, I don't think the receipt's in there. This was about £4.50 and it's just a really pretty mug that says mum on it, it's got little daisies on it and then it says you're blooming lovely, which I hope you can see. And then I got this, which says reserved for tea and biscuits. Mum is not a tea drinker, but I can put a coffee and shortbread on there in the morning. How cute is that? I just think that is so sweet. Like if you want to do something quite like simple, easy, but quite nice i thought it was a really good little gift idea so th i got that in my tiny sainsbury's not like a massive store so so it just goes to show they have them in the smaller branches as well because that was by no means the big supermarket so they've actually upped their game i also got a little pen that says super mum on it and i've got a bit of a problem because i don't know where i've put it but it is definitely here but that was also from sainsbury's then bag two from home bargains oh my gosh so I picked up the peaches and cream brush bag. It is amazing. It's pink. It's got like an acrylic holder in there. I would highly recommend. I think it's 30 pounds. Um, so that arrived and I've been using it. But then I also saw in Home Bargains, they have got the Kate Hayes one. Um, and this was 5 99 So I got this as a spare because I've got so many makeup brushes. It comes with the little zip, as you can see here on the front little compartment and the handle and this is really good if you want to store your makeup brushes somewhere i know that mine can take up quite a lot of space but i love kate anyway i spent some time with her in january to do like a little course but yeah i love her so i saw this and i thought i can use it for my spare little bits and bobs but the peaches and cream one is really good but if you're looking for like more of a budgety one that one you can't go wrong with I then also picked up a little thing of hand gel. I don't know why. I never used to carry it, but now I feel like I can't go anywhere without it. I also picked up these biodegradable face and body cleansing sponges. Let me grab the receipt. So the sponges were 69p for these. And these always remind me of when you're getting a facial done. And they used to use them like all over. It just makes you feel relaxing. So I got some for myself. I then also picked up, this actually isn't for me, but I got it for mum because she uses it. So this is the LV shampoo, £2.49 for each one, which I thought was quite good. Shampoo and everything's gone up so much now. I then, these are a bit of a, I hope they are okay. I got us these, just some little matching jarmies. They were £8 each, which I thought was quite good. Um, and it's a t-shirt and trousers, so... Here you go, actually, that's probably a better thing. Yeah, so nice and comfy, really soft material, and I just love me and mum having matching jammers. Normally we do it as a Christmas thing, ever since I can remember, but um, I thought it'd be quite nice for this weekend. I then picked up, these were the ones I think that were £1.99, yeah, a pack of three bamboo face cloths. I bought these before, I can never say that word, cloth. Oh, there we go. Pack of three for £1.49, and I love these to probably cleanse my face and take my makeup off. They never stay white, so I don't really know why I keep buying them, but they are really good. I then picked up this because it smelled really nice. Uh, where's the... This is 149. It's called Winter Care. No sulfates in it. It's the Winter Spice and Jasmine Body Wash. I opened it in the shop. Oh, it smells so nice. I love a good body wash. Then I picked up these because I just couldn't resist. If you haven't tried these, you need to, but they are quite spicy. These are the Sober Noodles and they were £1.59. Might have these later, actually. I got the chilli flavour, but they do curry and I think they do another one. But I've had the chilli one before and they are quite hot. 
Then picked up some little hair clips. I'm forever losing these when I'm curling and straightening my hair. These are pink and black and they were 99p and you get six in there. So, I mean, I've got one here. Luckily I remember to bring one, but genuinely, normally I forget them all the time. I also picked this up for mum. So this is like a little Olaplex dupe, but it is the Restoring Hair Oil. It was £2.49. And they've got the whole range in there. They've got the shampoo, they've got the conditioner. As you guys know, I use Olaplex, so maybe I should actually try this and give you like an update. But I picked up the oil for mum because she does like to give herself like a little bit of a pamper with her hair. I then picked up the Got To Be Brow and Edges of Hair Glue, £4.49. So you can use it for your brows, but you can also use it for like all your baby hairs. I actually borrowed my friend's one when we were on the Hendu last year in Portugal. And that was really good so I don't know why it's taking me so long to get it but I do love the refi one as well but this is much better as like a little budget one and then dupe alert I finally got my hands on the bum bum dupe so this was the only one they had in there and it's obviously the big one oh, it smells so good so they I've seen like all over um, TikTok the small ones and the sprays but they literally only had this and then I went to a second store to find it <laughs> I do love a dupe over here, but they didn't have any. So hopefully they might get them in, but I was glad to get the big one. This was £4.49. Um, let me just check that I got that right. Yeah, £4.49. And it's apparently vanilla almond and salted caramel, but to me it smells like the um, Sol de Janeiro one. Very much looks the same as well. So that is everything that I picked up from Home Bargains. As you can see, I've got to tidy this all away now and pack it up straight in the car to take home. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I do love a bit of Home Bargains, can't lie. So yeah, I'm gonna try this tonight and see what I think. And then um, I wanna go for like a nice walk along the beach. I do love it down here. It's like my happy place. It poured down last night, absolutely poured down. You could really hear it. But today's like brilliant sunshine, so nice and spring-like today for the time being but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you in my next video